I am Rashmi. Uh, today we make a methi gota, call it methi pakora, fenugreek leaves and coriander leaves. And you make it methi gota. So for that I have here uh, methi leaves. I already wash it. And here coriander leaves, right? I mix together. Then I microwave it for 60 seconds uh, so it's going soggy and 60 seconds so after 60 seconds wow. see the leaves everything going soggy and it's going like half I mean when I have half cup of uh, chorus whole wheat flour is call it lardo flour one tablespoon oil one cup of chana flour, chickpea flour, besan, some carom seeds, three uh, green chilies. I cut it like this. this. I have whole oil here, coriander seeds, and black pepper. A lot, right? I'm adding it. Salt for your taste. I add these leaves. After this, I add two tablespoon yogurt. Right? Yogurt make it nice spongy. Right? Mix it well and add warm water. Just little, little. When you need, add more. Don't put too much. Just add little more. Just little little warm water. If you put too much water, you get the oily pakora. So just leave for 15 minutes, okay? After 15 minutes, uh, see the flour, nice sticky everything. I add um, uh, half teaspoon sugar and just as a potato, little. And half teaspoon just a pinch of uh, you know the baking powder just little if you need add just little water and mix nicely just little so just pinch of baking powder make it nice crunchy use three fingers and you need the, the corner like so you get nice even round pakora don't drop like this just take it out uh, enough uh, dough and just make nice round pakora clean I'm just talking about border okay? nice nice pakora Make it nice uh, dark brown. See one side, one is pop up, change to other side. See this now color is like dark brown. Don't need too much dark. <laughs> That's the perfect color. See this all ready now. I'm putting the nice piece eat with yogurt if you like green chutney ketchup so I want to try so nice I love this pakora see inside is so see that's cook if you leave like for two minutes you cook so it's like this don't put on high heat dip in yogurt Mm. So yummy. Bye.